welcome to Craft Along number 21. Can you believe it? We've done 21 Craft Alongs. That's just crazy. Just crazy. Have so, you come up with all of these? I'm Lexi and this is Izzy, my lovely daughter and uh, crafting sidekick for the Craft Along series. And we're just really, really pleased to still be going and that you guys still love it. So thank you for watching. Um, I can see that somebody's joined us. So say hi um, and tell us who you are so we can say hello back. Um, so we're doing sock dresses today. We have our, this is Emma, Izzy's wonderful doll. Um, so what you're going to need today is... Yes, socks. Some old socks. So this came about because it, Izzy grew out of her socks and we had a pile of old socks. And I was just like, what are we going to do with all these? Well, you saw a, a tutorial on, on YouTube, I think, didn't you? Or something. No, I did no? not. Okay, this is all her own idea. Um, so you'll need some socks and you'll need some scissors. And uh, today, just for decoration, I'm going to be using some lovely stick-on gems. So you can get these from Hobbycraft, Poundland, those, those kind of places, the range, <coughs> the range sell them too. Um, get some really nice ones on Hobbycraft, but yes. they're a few out of stock. Yes, they didn't have the ones we wanted, but we've got some nice ones anyway. So you don't need a lot. Um, other things that you could use, you could use an elastic band. So Izzy's dress that the doll's wearing now has got an elastic band. So you could use ribbon or elastic bands, um, and you could also... Um, this is the dress that was in the event photo. So um, this isn't actually made out of a sock, I've realised. Um, it's out a long, uh, a long top sleeve. A long sleeve top, an old one. Um, yeah. But the girls have stuck a butterfly. The girls. The girls you and Izzy stuck, um, <laughs> other one Izzy, stuck butterfly stickers on, which I think look amazing. Um, so yeah, this second, this is the second craft along we've done with socks. Um, the first one was quite early on in lockdown, and we we showed how to make some basic dresses and a cape, a cape for the boys and the teddies. Aww. So, um, but we went and saw some of our good friends. So another friend of Izzy's is called also called Isabel. So hi Izzy, if you're watching, Izzy showed us how to make some very cool cardigans for um, these dolls. So these dolls are, they're quite big, they're, these ones are our generation, you can get them from Argos. Not our generation, Designer Friend. Our generation is the other one. So these are Designer Friend. Um, and yeah, so Izzy showed us how to do uh, these shrugs and cardigans, so thank you to her and we're going to pass it on to you. So we did ask if it was alright to share. So would you like to, we're going to show you how to do a dress and, and a cardi. And we have Izzy's already done do the dress, but... You know. Oh no, I thought we were going to do a dress out of that. Yeah, we have already done a dress yes. in a tutorial. But yes. Yeah, so I'll put the link to that down below. So you can do tops and skirts and a superhero cape. Yes. Okay, right, do you want to get cracking then and show everyone what to do? Yeah. This, is, um, this isn't one of my, my crafty crafty things, so I'm just here just here to ask questions. So get going. Okay. So you're going to make a dress first. Yeah. So, for the dress, you're going to need a sock. I, I'm I'm just using this sock because I found it. Um, and then you're gonna. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're so professional to the very end, aren't we? I'm so sorry about that. It's obviously popped oh, no. out. That's oh, there we go. That, that. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh, we're we're real life people here. Now I can't get this to to go um. how I want. It's alright. I've got you. You craft. I'll faff. <laughs> Now I'm very lopsided. You are. I'm so sorry. Um, how can I do this? There we go. Hang on. It's right. I've got it. I've got it. You see? Just... Okay. Okay, go for it. Right. Sorry, everybody. <laughs> right, go for it. Okay. So you, um... You want to cut... The toe. The toe. Off your sock. Before we go any further, I should say that um, make sure you check, if you're a child watching this on your own, make sure you check with mummy and daddy that you can actually cut your socks up. Please, please don't go into your sock drawer or even uh, or mummy and daddy's sock drawer and raid their socks because I will be in big trouble. Um, so yeah, make sure they're old socks that you've grown out of or that might be a little bit worn. Um, so just just saying that now before um, before everybody goes and, and break, gets all their socks. I'm just going to move that. 
<laughs> oh, um, Rania says look, she likes your nail varnish Thank colours. You. She's got different coloured toes as well, which are rather fabulous. <laughs> I'm going to a festival. We hope you're well. Mm. Nice to see you. Um, then... Oh, oh, look, Isabel's watching. Hi, Isabel. Hi, Karen. Hello. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Bring them on camera. Bring what? Oh, sorry. Um, yes, right, carry on. Anyway, so cut the toe yeah. off your sock. And then you want to... You want to then find this side. This is the side at the top, or you can use the other side that you cut the toe. It really doesn't matter. I think the top that looks better. Actually, yeah, because it? like the you've the got the collar bit. Um, then you want to cut a little triangle. I don't know how to do this. You cut a little triangle. So come back a bit. There you go. There That's we it, go. Just so people can see. That's it. So you're cutting a triangle. From the, the ankle bit of your sock, you're cutting two triangles, so one either side. So that's an armhole. So come, 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 come. Oh, oh for goodness good. sake! Oh, God, this is you. Try not to knock it. Sorry. Everybody. Sorry, we're having technical issues. I'm going to hold it. Right, carry <laughs> on. <laughs> okay. Um, then you want to do the same to the other side. Not cutting there. Oh, I'm really sorry. This normally doesn't happen with mm -hmm. our um, our tripod, but it's obviously having a bit of a nightmare. My camera is quite slippery, so um, it keeps keeps um, jumping around. Anyway, so Izzy has cut two triangles. They're they're very wonky. I'm sorry. That's all right. It always happens. Um, so you want the toe, the heel of your sock is going to be the back of your dress, um, so the the doll's bottom can still sit in. Um, and then you've got two holes now um, underneath the, the ankle band of your sock. So it really is that simple. And then you just pull it on. Don't don't be scared to be vigorous because it can be a bit tricky sometimes. Shall we um shall we get it on? Yeah. Pull that down. Thank you, Doki. Careful of the scissors, no cutting her hair. No. Oh, and also a very funny thing that me and Isabel did. We made pants for our dolls. <laughs> yes, and the last craft along we did was um, uh, we somebody made a COVID mask for their teddies as well. I've done that. Funny. Um, I did it. Also, if we've got loads of old socks. We've been saving them for absolutely ages. So what um, is also quite nice is to cut off the band, the band, the elastic kind of ankle band of your sock. And turn it into a belt. So um, that's we what ha I have a black one to go with we've my done. red one. Yeah, that's what we've done here. Okay, so there you go. And then if you want to add your belt, you go. slip it on Just or slip it overhead. on. Move your hand in it. There we go. There you go. Lovely. So it kind of just finishes off the outfit like it does anybody's. Um, <laughs> so uh, that that's that's how you make a dress. Just a little recap. So um, the next thing is to make a cardigan. Let's know if you're crafting along with us. We would love to know um, if you're actually crafting and making with us. And uh, right. there you go. Just give her a little catwalk. Okay, so right. the the shrug or jacket. The jacket. So come come this way a little bit so everyone can see. Let's move your bits. Right. So you can do this with any part of the sock. So like if you're doing it with the heel, you just cut out heel. I'm gonna do it up here. So you've got a nice nice long. So sock. if I've got a long sock, I'm gonna cut just above the heel. If it will cut. It's easier to pull it taut to cut it. There yeah. Go. And then cut the band off if you want to. I mean, it, it just looks better without the band on. So I'm going to cut off the band. So that could have been your belt. That could be also a hairband. Oh, yes. I'll do that. <laughs> yes. So that could be, be careful of her lovely fringe. I like her fringe. And then um, you want to put your hand inside. Got a little thingy, a tube. Thingy, tube. tube. Oh, sorry. And like pinch it. Take your hand out and like cut the pinch. I guess you could say. So this is just really like a 
an entry point, isn't it? So you're just actually making a hole. Yeah, so basically make a hole. That's how I... In the, in the middle. Yeah, so you can see my hand. And then you just want to go round, making the hole a bit bigger. Yeah, so flatten it out on the table, and then you want to cut a square or a rectangle shape. More like a rectangle. Yeah. Rectangles always work best. If it's easier, you can always get pencil and draw the rectangle to, to cut, especially if you're a little bit younger. Um, and obviously, just watch your fingers. Yes, I am being very careful, and definitely watching my scissors. I'm sorry, I, I'm kind of not. So, has everyone finished school for the summer now? We've we our schools broke up today. Have you of your or your home school or your actual school, um, home school and school broke up today, um, for us. So, are you you guys anyone else still at school for a few days next week, or are we all are we all free? Let us know in the comments. That'll be lovely to know. Finally free. Finally free. Oh, not basically. Free from homeschooling. Yes, Rania says rest. yes, they're all free. Oh, have you got any plans? Got any plans for the summer holidays? It's really difficult to make plans at the moment, isn't it? There you go. Right, so show that to the camera. Um, just, no, 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 show it flat. So, that's it. No, that's it. The other way. Back a bit. Back, back, back. Right, there we go. So, it almost looks a little bit like a tissue box. Um, kind of <laughs> <laughs> just imagine tissue box when, you, when you're doing this um, so it, uh, basically a hole or it can be a uh, rectangle or kind of like an oval shape and there you go that's easy as pie so pop so, that on one arm you might want to make the, lo the longer the, s the longer the bit the better because I mean so you can then have longer sleeves but I obviously did not think of that it's more of a more of a little little shrug and then and you can then see we've it. added on a lovely hairband as well. So she's got the whole look. And then you can add some gems. Do you want to do that? Yes, I do. I'm just trying to sort out her twisted jumper here. Oh, Hope went for her last day today. Oh, is that is that primary school all finished, I think? I think you said on Facebook. That's sad. <laughs> so sad. <laughs> So if you want to add some gems or some stickers, um, make sure your stickers are proper, really sticky, sticky stickers. Um, sticky, otherwise sticky, they'll just sticky. not paper ones. So this one's um, a plasticky, a plasticky one. And um, yeah, they they tend to stay on a little bit better. And then you can kind of add your gems on in a bit of a funny, funky style. There you go. I just added a few. Oh, back a bit. Sit down, Emma. <laughs> I did a few get gems. close because it's all blurry. That's it. Back. There we go. Yeah, it looks like buttons. Uh, oh, first like. school. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. We hope you enjoyed that tutorial. If you've crafted along with us or if you're going to have a go over the weekend or the summer holidays, we would really love to see um, what you what fashion um, outfits you make. Um, and... And, you know, there's so many things you could do. So do this, us a fashion show. Yeah, do us a fashion show. So this dress has got the front cut out, so it's long at the back, and then it's like a trail. Front, lovely. Um, you can, yeah, like with the other one, or is it this one? You can cut a hole in the front and add, um, add an elastic band. So there's so much you can do. And so the much possibilities are endless. <laughs> I know. So we would love to see what you come up with. Um, we hope you have enjoyed it. And we're going to be back next week. Austin has requested. He made these at school. Oh um, these shakers at school. So they're out of yogurt pots. Um, so start saving your yogurt pots for next week. He would really like to share with you how to make these. Um, he's been asking me for weeks. So I said yes. Um, so it might not be as easy. He may or may not join us next week. Probably not. <laughs> But he's really keen to show how to do that. So I will share the um, next week event in the comments. I will share the tutorial for the other dressed, um, dressed craft along that we did in the comments as well. So you can get some more inspiration. Um, so have a fabulous week. Enjoy crafting. And we'll be back next week. Thank you for crafting along with us. And I'm so sorry for all the technical um, crazy camera antics. <laughs> I'm sorry if it, you thought it was you. <laughs> See you not. later. Thank you. Bye. Bye.